Hey, this is Nick J. Bat, and this not so quick little video, I want to talk about this place, uh, pixelpipe.com, which is perfitting and fits in with this and videos that I've been doing um, on this which is the iPhone 4 uh, and its HD recording function uh, it shoots HD I don't think the camera is as good as the uh, Sony Ericsson Vivas um, I think it does a lot better job but that's uh, an argument for another video um, now the problem with this is that the HD video um, here's a video that I shot earlier, not that one, this one. Um, Now, it wasn't a coincidence that on my fascinating little test video there, I happened to use the uh, band called, the Scottish band called Garbage, because basically um, the video once uploaded through uh, the iPhone 4's in-house uh, to YouTube facility, as you can see it's compressing here, um, the quality on uh, once live on YouTube is little more than garbage, uh, meaning that, um, as you can see here, it's taking quite a short time to compress this file, and this file is a 230 megabyte HD file. Um, so that should kind of give alarm bells uh, running, you know, sort of ringing straight away. Um, now I have talked about this in other videos and there was a solution but I'll just sort of show you um, right so it's asking me to put in a title description and tag category I'll leave it there it's not important. Now we're going to publish it. Don't know why it keeps doing that, dropping out. But basically, um, the uh, the alternative to this was to um, was to basically kind of go onto the YouTube site itself um, and upload the video via the website uh, attached to your home internet um, and kind of doing it that way really so you're kind of just locating the raw video file um, through the actual site itself you know going to your computer um, and sort of doing it that way or plugging it up to your computer, moving the raw file onto your desktop, and then uploading it to um, uploading it to YouTube. That kind of um, yielded a better result because basically the other result, um, the other way of doing it, if you're using it this way, the quality is that bad that um, you don't even get the uh, the option to you don't even get the option to play it back in 720p setting on the player now as you can see this is taking two minutes it's saying that it's taking two minutes to compress a 230 megabyte raw HD file which really if it was doing a better job it would take longer than that uh, so that's kind of alarm bell number two that it's going to do a crap job um, basically when it's finished so I'm going to stop this now because I don't want it to do that um, so basically the alternative uh, is, is uh, pixel pipe
which enables you to do it. You can upload via 3G, that probably costs you money though, via your internet service provider, uh, or you can do it uh, Wi Fi uh, from your home uh, internet, or if you're in a cafe which has got a hotspot, or you know, in your shopping mall, or whatever. Basically, this enables you to do it um, sort of without having to put it onto your computer first. Now, the first thing uh, Pixelpipe will ask you to do is once you've installed it, it will say that your location settings is not switched on. So, basically, what you do is you go to settings on your iPhone, down to general. And you go to location settings services, I should say, location services, and then you go all the way down to you find pixel pipe, and then you just press on. Um, so if we go back to pixel pipe, now pixel pipe uh, settings, you have all these places that you can basically the whole idea of this is that I presume all of these will do your HD uploads but you can send if you've got um, if you've got accounts at all these places then you can send your HD video and your pictures um, to all these places with one click of a button so it's a multi upload if you like to all these different places um, and there's a load there, you know, there's all your usual, your Viddler, your Tumblr, your Facebook, your Facebook pages, um, your, all the Twitter variations, TypePad, uh, MySpace, I don't know why anyone would want to send anything to MySpace anymore other than, um, well, we won't go into that, uh, Vimeo, uh, Viddler, uh, TweetPix, Etc. 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 You can um, you can create blog posts or status updates. Um, you know you click that there, uh, and then you're basically posting to a blog. You click that there, then you're um, setting you're posting to whatever of the services you've clicked on, and it will send it simultaneously to all those places. Now basically what we've got here is it automatically finds um, all your videos now that video is not there because I've just deleted it because in an earlier video when I just tried to do this um, it was 230 megabytes and it said that the video was 230 megabytes and with, no, it said that it was over 200 megabytes and it was too long to be sent. So I'm guessing that 200 is the top limit that this will actually upload. So this was another little test video that I, I shot. I'll shoot it again so that you can, um, just so you can see it populate. Uh, well, it, uh, Right, okay. Right. So just as you can see, you can't see on it at the moment, but you will do in a minute. So play that. So just as you can see, you can't see on it at the moment, but you will do in a minute. This is the uh, Logitech 9000. Oh, the sound seems to come. It's basically got a manual iris, which basically means that uh, the exposure can be manually uh, manipulated and it doesn't go light and dark every time the, the camera moves slightly. Uh, shoots HD, very good wired HD um, webcam. Right, okay, we get the idea anyway, so that's our video. Um, so basically, this... Which one that was? Right, okay, so I'm going to select that one, and then I'm going to go upload. It's showing me that it's uploading there, but it's not really showing me how long it's going to take, so I have to go to Q, uh, and then you can see it uploading there. 
uh, and it's taking 11 minutes now that's a very short that video wasn't that big but you can see it's taken a longer amount of time already I can't tell from this side at the moment what size the video is but you know 10 minutes probably for a I don't know a three minute ramble is probably about right and it will give you the uh, HD playback function so that's it for this video